Welcome to my second vlog where we're going to go behind the scenes of my most recent launch day. I recently just added these t-shirt rulers to my site. They are super awesome. They help when making t-shirts because you're able to line up your design. So I decided to launch these along with all of my Christmas apparel. First things first, I wanted to take product pictures of my rulers so that I could upload them on my site before launch day. One of my favorite small business finds is this impact LED photo booth that I use for all of my product pictures and social media pictures. So I just went ahead and grabbed some props, a t-shirt, and then my t-shirt ruler and began taking some product pictures. After I was finished taking my product pictures, I went inside, edited my photos, and then hopped on my website to do some behind the scenes things like upload my listings, write my descriptions, and things like that. Here's the aftermath of my listing and what it looks like on my site. After that was all finished, I went to go pick up an order by Printware of Oregon. They made me some embroidered crewnecks, which I'm really obsessed with. You'll see later in the video, and here I am just unloading them from my car. Like I said, these new crewnecks are super cute, and it's safe to say that I'm obsessed with them. They are super high quality. I love the corded material, and the gingerbreads are so cute. I had two boxes of these to unload, so once I brought them in the house, I was able to start branding them. I used these transfers from Transfer Express that I customized with my Cricut Mini Press, and I just iron on my logo in the inside of the shirt. While I was at the print house, I also picked up another order I had done, which was this cute crew neck. I am obsessed with it. They used puff ink, so it's kind of a 3D you can see here in the video. The color and the quality is unmatchable. I think this might be my favorite thing to come to my website. I ordered 80 of these crew necks, so I had to get busy folding them. Here I am after I branded them, I'm just folding to get ready to put them on my shelves. And of course, Willow was here to help me. As always, she's the star of the video. Once it was 6 o'clock, orders started rolling in like crazy. These lines are people ordering from my site, and then I also recorded a screenshot on my phone because it was pretty insane how many orders came in in just a short period of time. Next, I got busy logging onto my site and printing out all my shipping labels and packing slips. Once I had all of my labels and packing slips sorted, I went over to my bins here that I organized all my shirts in and I started to grab orders. Here are two of my shirts that I had for Christmas. There was this farm fresh one with a vintage truck on it and then I also had this long sleeve shirt that says freezing. They're both super cute and super comfortable, both comfort colors. I started packing my orders, I did them in batches because not all of them would fit on this table here. So there's actually a story behind this. I got these boxes from the post office in hopes that they would fit my rulers and I made a mistake and made all 20 of them before actually putting the ruler in the box to see if it would fit. Long story short, they did not fit so I made all these boxes for no reason. On top of getting the wrong boxes, I also had the flu. I was sicker than I had ever been and it was finals week for school so everything was just adding up. I was also flying out of state in the next couple of days and needed to ship out my orders before I left for California. So 
All in all, I didn't have any boxes for my orders. I was freaking out and I ordered from Uline and I was gonna pay for overnight shipping, but I decided not to and I was gonna have my friend package them while I was gone. But luckily Uline ended up shipping my order and it came the next day. This meant that I had my boxes to ship out my rulers and they were perfect, so now I know to use these ones and not the ones from the post office. It was quite the stressful week with everything that was going on, and as much fun as it looks like I'm having in this video, I was actually having no fun at all because I was still getting over the flu. A little backstory on the rulers is that my dad made me one when I started my t-shirt business and it's been incredible. I usually post it in all of my videos that I have because I use it every time I make a shirt. People started commenting and asking where I got mine from because it looked like it was heavy duty. So I collaborated with my dad, he made me the rulers and now I'm selling them on my site. The rulers he makes are made out of a high quality acrylic that's pretty thick and unlike the Amazon ones, they don't melt under your heat press and they've lasted forever. I've had mine for over two years. Once I was finished packing all my rulers and t-shirts, I laid them out like this so I could get some social media videos and photos. Once my little photo shoot was done, I got my bags from the post office and I started loading up all my packages. Fast forward to the next day, this is when my friend and I got out of nursing school, we had just taken our final and both of us got 97%, I'm so proud of us, um, but after that we decided to load up all my packages in the car, we seriously did not think it was going to fit because there were so many, but somehow we ended up getting it all to fit and we took the Honda Fit to go fill up with gas, go to the post office and the UPS store. Just a little shout out to Kira for being so awesome. I don't know what I would do without her. She helped me load and unload all my packages and drop them off at the post office. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and seeing what it looks like behind the scenes of a launch day all the way from the beginning to the end. Let me know what you thought in the comments below and we'll see you next time.